today, Aaron takes a sip of coffee. We discover how small I really am. And I say something that blows Aaron's mind. Well folks, welcome back to another episode of the Gideon's Tactical Show. We're letting it out of the closet. After seven years of camera angles and wearing lifters and uh, you know video tricks, it comes out that I am smaller than my wife. At a whopping 5'6", she towers over me. <laughs> In all seriousness, folks, welcome back. This is gonna be a real quick video. Uh, my wife and I, Mrs. GT, Ashley and I, uh, just wanted to share a quick idea that she laid down on me about a week ago. I've shared it with like six, seven people and they're like, that is blowing my mind. So I figured that I would have her share just for a moment and I'm gonna give you my thoughts as well on this idea. So babe, what did you lay down on me a few days ago that just like, Blew me away. Blew me away. The idea that I brought up to Aaron was the idea of being creators versus consumers. And I know I saw this some, somewhere on Instagram, and I'm sorry I can't give the credit to any particular post because I don't can't remember where I saw it. But I know that um, it's really changed the way that I view my everyday life. Um, to try to look at the day as what am I going to create today um, because really we we were created in the image of God and he is our creator but I believe he's put that in us to create and to be fruitful um, on this earth and thinking of it that way has really given me a sense of purpose on how I can create a good day for my kids or create things with my kids um, or just you know do some artsy things that I like to do and it's kind of just given me a spark of um, interest in life and creativity that I'm, I'm really happy about um, also just thinking about it um, I was just thinking about how when we consume and consume and consume but we're not doing anything with it then we become stagnant and um, just boring and creating really helps to kind of give something back to the world around us and um, that's why I really like this idea so boom mind blown guys where in your life are you just being a consumer and not a creator when Mrs. GT dropped that thought on me. I was like, oh my gosh, I consume so much entertainment, consume even, you know, reading, and even though reading is good, and we've talked about that here on the channel, I was like, whoa, what am I doing with my hands, with my thoughts, with, with who I am to create? Now, of course, I create content here at Gideon's Tactical all the time, and that's great, and that is one avenue of creativity, but that's one avenue, and I want to begin to become a lot better at being more of a creator in my life life than a consumer and this can be very simple this can start out in very simple ways simple activities you don't have to get all crazy and like oh my gosh what does that mean for me think of some things though that maybe you can either start to build you can start to um, put your mind to simple things like I, I literally have bought a puzzle it's a 3d puzzle I may even run in some b-roll if I get to it tonight it's Friday night we're gonna post this tomorrow morning I might roll in some if I can uh, a 3d puzzle the, of a camera it's like an old um, like turn of the century camera camera that looks awesome. It's like a hundred pieces. I haven't put a puzzle together in probably a decade, but I want to create something. It's going to make my, my brain synapses fire in different ways than they have in a while. Uh, what, what maybe can you build with your hands versus just purchasing? Like, yeah, it would be way easier to go, you know, buy some sort of thing, maybe sh a shelf, you know, that you need versus like, Hey, let's try and build this thing. Yeah. It's going to take way more energy. Yes. It's going to take me a week versus just going over to Walmart and buying something, but creating things and, and taking uh, the step to attempt to create things, I think is going to really change my life, my wife's life, our family. I'm already starting to do this with GT Junior and GT Junior Mark II as well. We're trying to pick like a day a week where we do an arts and craft and we really create something. Regardless if it's like a little bird feeder, a race car that you blow up with a balloon and like that, you know, sends it, whatever it may be, but creating new meals. I mean, it can be simple things, but really start to think about this because this isn't just like our idea and actually just happened to see it, you know, on some sort of uh, Instagram. I mean, it's, it's a growing movement for people. Think of like your kids learning by doing, give them activities don't just you show them you know have them build things uh, that's our sons are just starting to get into like Duplo and stuff and it's great to see their creativity and have them start to create things on their own but 
folks, this is a very simple concept that we will be doing more of. I'm gonna start giving you guys um, ways on how you can be creative versus consuming and become a creator in your life. And again, simple things like cool puzzles I find or cool activities I do with GT Junior and Junior Mark II, things that Mrs. GT and I do that create things together. We will be doing this continually and, and coming back to this idea because I think it is a, a revolutionary thing. Because in the short term, consuming, you know, you're on consuming Instagram, you're consuming Facebook, you're consuming YouTube, you're consuming Netflix, and you're consuming everything around you, music. But how much of your life are you actually creating anything? And I, I looked at my life and I'm like, not a lot. And I need to be creating a lot more. So it's a challenge for us as a family that we're also laying down for our GT family as well, that we want you guys to start challenging yourself to become creators in your life. And I believe it it, it, it may take a little bit longer to get the, the satisfaction out of life, but I, th I think it'll produce way, way longer lasting results in your life by being a creator versus a consumer. So guys, that's it for today. Just wanted to drop that on you. I hope it's been fun, entertaining, and informative. Mrs. GT, anything else you want to say? Get out there and create. Cool. Uh, check us out on Instagram, Facebook, all the social media. Um, we are going to be doing Instagram giveaways super quick. We Super soon. We did uh, hit our 20,000 followers this week, which is awesome. So we're just waiting on a couple items from some of the giveaways to come in, and then we'll uh, start doing the two giveaways that we have. We're going to pick two winners, um, hopefully sometime next week on Instagram. So if you're not following us yet there, definitely follow us on Instagram. That's a cool way to, to see what's up and coming projects I'm working on. And uh, yeah, love you guys. You're awesome. Stay equipped. Stay prepared. And we'll see you out there.